Identifying your quick disconnects is always a challenging thing. So we're here today to help you identify exactly what you have with regard to size and type of your quick disconnect. As you'll see in front of me, I've got five different types of quick disconnects. The first one in line is our HT series, which is the ISO 16028 skid steer quick disconnect. The next one in line is our 700 series, which is the ISO 7241-B. The next one in line is our ISO, our, it's our 600 series, our ISO 7241-A, and then finally our AG coupler, often referred to as a Pioneer coupler, which is our ISO 5675. And finally, our wet line coupler, which is our 4100 series quick disconnect. Now you look at them and you say, well, how am I supposed to know which is which? They all look kind of the same, with the exception of this one. So what we've done for you is we've created an incredibly handy chart in the back of our catalog. So if you flip to the back of the catalog, you will see this chart. And this chart is going to help you identify exactly what it is you have. So starting with our HT series, you've got, take your mail coupler and you're going to lay it down right on our chart and you're going to try and figure out what size it is that actually matches the fitting that you have. And as you can see, that matches perfectly with the half inch HT series flush face coupler. The next one in line is going to be a little bit of a larger head. And I told you this is going to be our ISO 7241B, but questioning how do you know it's not A? Well, if you line this up with the half inch A, it really does not line up very nicely. So if you slide it over to the B, you will see that that is a perfect match to the half inch ISO Series B 7241, our 700 series. The next one in line, same thing. You're going to match that up perfectly with the half inch ISO 7241 Series A, which is our 600 series. Your AG slash Pioneer coupler is going to be perfectly lined up with the ISO 5675 half inch coupler. And as you'll see the difference here, these are almost same size. One has a poppet, one has a ball. So it's really going to help you identify exactly what it is you have.